Hey, welcome to this video. You arrived here. You're probably searching for a view of Ztrip. I'll go over how it works. I'll give you my two cents, whether I think it's a good use of your time. And if you'd like my free training on the number one simplest, fastest way to earn a full-time income from home, you can click the link below. You'll see my email opt-in page. Enter your best email. I can send you my free training if you want. Z code, let's dive in. So what it is, basically, it's an app that is sort of a cross between, you know, your popular ride-sharing apps like Uber or Lyft and your old school taxi services. Now, Ztrip was founded in 2016. And from the customer's perspective, it's nice and convenient because they can book a trip um, immediately or for a future date um, from their phone. And from the driver's perspective, which is what I'm assuming you're here for, it's also nice because it gives you lots of freedom and flexibility uh, in terms of your schedule uh, because you'd be an independent contractor not an employee. And you're not also not risking damage to your vehicle um, or wear and tear on your vehicle because you're actually driving Z-Trips uh, vehicles, their cars, uh, which is pretty unique. Um, you can drive your own vehicle, but most of the drivers choose to use uh, Z-Trips. And they'll pay for the insurance, they'll handle um, you know any repairs or maintenance, they offer 24-7 support. So if you have any difficulties while you're on the road, uh, you can reach out to them and they'll help you. And the income potential on here is quite good. Um, depending on what city you live in, there are people earning, drivers earning, you know, $200 a day uh, plus take-home pay um, after all expenses are handled. And another pro with Ztrip is you're providing a service that people actually need. Um, you know, um, you know, people need to get to their medical appointments, especially elderly folks. They need to um, get to the airport or whatever it is. It's not one of those jobs that can be uh, outsourced um, like, you know, a lot of these apps or a lot, of, a lot of jobs in general can be outsourced This is or automated. This is something that you actually need a real person to drive the car. Um, and there's always going to be a demand. Now, the main con or disadvantage of driving for Z trip is it's it's uh, there's quite an expensive lease you'll have to pay, um, and uh, so so it's a fee you'll have to pay around five hundred dollars a week depending on the city, and that's regardless of how many hours you put in. So if you're thinking you're just going to do this part time, like twenty hours a week, this app isn't for you. It's probably only worth it if you're gonna be doing working 40 plus hours a week, because if you're only doing 20 hours a week, you, you'll be lucky to break even with the $500 fee. Um, and you'll have to pay for fuel as well. That's another thing you need to consider. But if you're willing to put in 40 hours a week or more, this could be a good opportunity and you live in the right city. Now, if you're interested in signing up, you just have to come to drive with Z trip. You'll be taken to this page and uh, you must be 25 years old. Submit your name, email, phone number, city. Um, so may, hopefully you're available in one of these cities. Uh, not been convicted of a felony within the last 10 years. And they will check. Um, they'll do fingerprint analysis, a full background check. Um, so it is a bit of a process to get accepted. It's not as easy as some of the, as quick as some of these other apps. But, um, and then, uh, and then also, and then you'll need to download the app on the from the Google Play or the Apple Store, so iOS or Android device, because all communication is mostly going to be done through the app and seeing the you know the job listings and the map, and um, and then um, and then if once you've submitted all this, you'll need to schedule an interview with them, and and um, so again, it is a bit of a process. Um, and then you'll need, you know, the app, which I mentioned. Um, and they also talk about how you can build a personal clientele. So that's another feature on here. It allows riders to uh, rate you, to rate their favorite dri and, and favorite their uh, drivers they like, so that you could build a client base, which is a good situation to be in because it can give you steady work, uh, generous tips, you know, familiar routes. If you can drive for the same people over and over again, it's always nice. Um, you know, all in all, Z Trip is a perfectly good company. 
Um, they have a, a fleet of 60,000 vehicles, so they must be doing something right. They've expanded pretty quickly. Um, if you come to a lot of the complaints out there, you'll find are from not drivers, but customers. Uh, people saying, you know, my driver wasn't professional. It took them, you know, two, they were an hour and a half late. But from the driver's perspective, you know, things are mostly good. Um, so 4.1 star rating on Glassdoor. And these are a lot of drivers leaving reviews. So, um, you know, a lot of people like that, that you get paid every day. That's one thing they liked. Um, it's an easy to navigate app. It's an easy job. Um, you know, they pay on time. The only cons were, um, you know, the, the lease, that was the biggest complaint, the $500 per week lease. Um, some people also complained they felt their car was old and broken down. And, and one person left a complaint that the user, the customer experience wasn't great, which negatively impacted them as a driver. So, but they're kind of vague about that, but all in all, um, overwhelmingly positive experiences. So you can uh, just go through the reviews there. And um, again, the only real complaint, I, the common complaint is the $500 a week lease. You can get that down to around $250, so half, if you decide to drive your own vehicle, but you might not wanna do that because then you'll be responsible for all the repairs and maintenance and everything that go, and insurance and everything that goes into that. Um, but Z code, you can check it out if you want and just do the math, see if it makes sense for you. Uh, but again, this is not something where you, you're you gonna work you know, 12, 20 hours a week. You need to be willing to work, I'm gonna say at least 30, probably more like 40 plus hours a week if you wanna make it worth your while because of that big $500 a week fee. And that's it, so you can check it out. But look, maybe you're here not necessarily because you wanna be a driver. Maybe you're just looking for a simple, reliable way to earn money and maybe earn money from the comfort of your own home. If that's the case, what I suggest is click the link below. You'll see my email opt-in page. Enter your best email. I can send you my free training if you want. And that's it. I hope you enjoy this review. I hope to see you on the other side, and I hope you have a great day. Bye.